I'm Micah Bestick. This is Kat Pitakelli. We're the dietitians at St. Vincent's Weight Loss Services, and we're here to talk to you about National Fitness and Sports Month, which is May 2018. The benefits, a lot of us might know, just after exercising, we can feel the benefits ourselves: or increase mood, increase flexibility, uh, less pressure in our joints. The benefits are endless. I like to remind people it's more than just something you might see on a scale. But in knowing that, we improve, improve blood sugar and blood flow and, and help our heart muscle. Only one in five people exercise to the point where we get the benefits of physical activity. We wanted to share with you what the recommendations are, which is 150 minutes of cardio movement throughout the entire week and then two days a week moving all of your major muscle groups in the strength training way. So strength training all the major muscle groups twice a week. So that brings us to our top three tips for May um, for getting in our physical, the recommended levels of physical activity each week. And our top tip is to find activities that you enjoy. If you absolutely hate the exercise that you're doing, you are not terribly likely to do it very long. Um, so find activities that you enjoy, whether that means recruiting a friend to work out with you, or maybe playing great music while you go for a walk by yourself, or getting involved in group fitness if you enjoy group activities. Um, but find exercise, find movement each day that you enjoy. Like Kat said, recruiting support is key. Some people like to get a trainer or have a workout buddy, and that can pose a challenge just with people's schedules or if family members or close workout buddies may live in a different state or different part of the city. It's easy to utilize our resources, such as Facebook, and create a weight loss group where you can have friendly competitions on like who took so many, the most steps this day or let's see who can get the most minutes of exercise each day and then it's also a great way to support each other too so in this day and age anything is possible use the internet and then our third and final tip is to stay positive uh, sometimes we have to be kind of gentle with ourselves and to remember that even getting in a little bit of movement or a little bit of activity each day is better than nothing. So some is better than nothing at all. And I feel like I even have to remind myself of this, that it doesn't have to be a 30 to 60 minute workout for it to count. In fact, research shows that as long as you're getting in those 10 minute bouts of cardiovascular activity, you are getting the benefit. So the idea is to just make sure that you're getting in some each day and that that's better than nothing. So next month, uh, well for June, stay tuned and we will talk about how to maximize your success. Take care. Thanks guys.